Hello friends. This video is brought to you by MyWayTeaching.com. Let us start with this interesting chapter on simple equation. Firstly we will understand what is an equation. Then we shall learn how to form equation from statements. We shall then move to solving an equation and further do some examples of application of simple equations. Let us start by recalling constants and variables. A constant is usually some number. It can be 2, 3, root 5, anything. It has to be a number. While a variable takes a different numerical value and it is denoted by some alphabet say X or Y or Z or L, M and so on. In other words, we can say that value of a constant is fixed while that of a variable is not fixed. Next is expressions. The expressions are formed by performing operations like addition, subtraction, multiplication or division on the variables and constants. For example, let us consider the expression 4x plus 5. To form this expression, we multiplied 4 with x and then added 5 to the product. Similarly, we can also have say 10y minus 20. To form this expression, we will multiply y with 10 and then subtract 20 from the product. Both of these are examples of expressions. The value of the expression formed depends upon the chosen value of the variable. That means, suppose we take x equal to 1, then the value of 4x plus 5 will be 4 into 1 plus 5 which is equal to 4 plus 5 which is equal to 9. Similarly by choosing some value of y say y equal to 2 we can get the value of the expression 10 by minus 20 that will be 10 into 2 minus 20 that is 20 minus 20 and it comes out to be 0. Now if we put some condition on our expression then it can be an equation. For example if I say that 4x plus 5 is equal to 65 then 4x plus 5 equal to 65 is an equation similarly if I say 10y minus 20 equal to 50 then again 10y minus 20 equal to 50 is an equation so we can say that an equation is a condition on a variable. Also note that in an equation there is always a equality sign. This equality sign shows that the value of the expression to the left of the sign is equal to the value of the expression on the right of the sign. That means if we had 
फोर एक्स प्लस फाइव ग्रेटर देन सिक्सटी फाइव देन इट इज नॉट एन इक्वेशन बिकॉज इक्वेशन मीन्स इट शुड हैव अ इक्वालिटी साइन Similarly, the condition four x plus five less than sixty five is also not an equation. Now let us try to understand solution of equation. Let us take the same example four x plus five equal to sixty five. now it states that the value of this expression is 65 this condition is satisfied when x equal to 15 let us check how say we take x equal to 5 then 4x plus 5 will have the value 4 into 5 plus 5 that is 20 plus 5 which is equal to 25 and 25 is not equal to 65 that means x equal to 5 does not satisfy the condition that we have put on our expression and hence x equal to 5 is not the solution of the given equation let us check for x equal to 15 we get 4 into 15 plus 5 which is equal to 60 plus 5 which is equal to 65 that means for x equal to 15 we get 4x plus 5 equal to 65 we can say since for x equal to 15 the condition is satisfied hence it is a solution of the equation 4x plus 5 equal to 65 let us try to find the solution of 10y minus 20 equal to 50 let us check for y equal to 5 then 10y minus 20 is equal to 10 into 5 minus 20 which is equal to 50 minus 20 which is equal to 30 and Our condition is that it should be equal to fifty. That means y equal to five is not a solution. Let us try for y equal to six. Then ten y minus twenty becomes. 10 into 6 minus 20, which is equal to 60 minus 20, which is equal to 40. Again, the condition is not satisfied. Hence, y equal to 6 is not a solution. Let us check if y equal to 7 is a solution. we get 10 into 7 minus 20 which is equal to 70 minus 20 which is equal to 50 hence for y equal to 7 the condition is satisfied and hence y equal to 7 is the solution of equation 10y Minus twenty equal to fifty. It is now time to note that often we use the right hand side 
as a number but this need not be always so 4x plus 5 equal to 6x minus 25 is also an equation that means we can have expressions on both sides of the equation we also note a simple and useful property of equation the equation 4x plus 5 equal to 65 is same as 65 equal to 4x plus 5 That means, ten y minus twenty equal to fifty is same as writing fifty is equal to ten y minus twenty. Hence, we come to the conclusion that an equation remains the same when the expression on the left.